Hey, what's going on? Steve here at the DJ Lab, and look what I found while I was cruising around the internet. Another picture of the Denon DJ SC Live 4. And not only that, the Denon DJ SC Live 2. Seems like one of the retailers got trigger happy, popped up the pictures on their website showing the deal with the case. And, you know, an LED kit and all this other fun stuff. A nice little package deal with a nice lock there to lock everything up. And um, then they took it down. But it might be down, but when you go into Google Images and you do a search, you can find it still, right? Because it was still there. Um, yeah, so that's nice of them. We already knew, based on the other video and the one that Nick did, that Nick Spinelli. Shout out to Nick. You're always digging through the dirt, Nick. And uh, you got some good sources that hopefully don't lose their job because, you know, everyone's got non-disclosure agreements signed and they just ignore that shit. But, um, yeah, these are two new controllers. And we're going to see how good they really are because I think personally, this is just my opinion, that in music, which owns Denon, DJ, and they own Newmark, they got, like, boxes of parts laying around and they decide... We need to make something. We don't have access to new things. So what can we do with the existing parts that we have? And, you know what I mean? Like they took the, the that what was that the mix live or the mix track live, whatever the hell that new mark one was. I never played with one and I heard it's cool. You know what I mean? It is basically like they took a Denon DJ go and they made it a little bit better and took out the battery and added speakers. So this is kind of like they took the prime for and a Prime 2 and put in some speakers and take away a few things. And I don't know how good it's going to be. It's going to be interesting. It's, you know, let me tell you, this is not a replacement for the Prime series at all. This is basically that in between. So they could have called this a new mark. You know what I mean? And I'm sure they probably sat there and had a big discussion on do we call this the Newmark product, or are we going to call us a Denon product? Because it kind of sits in the middle of the two. You know what I mean? It's not quite good like Denon, and it's not as bad as Newmark. Not that Newmark's bad. It's just beginner stuff and built, you know, a little, a little on the cheaper side, let's say. So it's going to be really interesting to see one of these things when it's up and running to know exactly what's going on with it. Um, I'm thinking, at first I thought this was like a browser knob up here in the top corners. And now I'm believing that that's like the loop encoder knob. That makes more sense to me. I see like an in and out. This is like a little bit better of a picture. I can make a, a couple things a little bit more. Um, so yeah, this should be interesting to see how this turns out. Screen looks nice. Um, you know, everything looks pretty good about it. Hopefully they fix the effects. And now that we see rain, teasing pictures with the hardware effects and the new rain product maybe this guy here will actually have some hardware effects too that would be nice but don't hold your breath on it anyways i'm sure it's going to be compatible with serato would kind of make sense to me but uh mainly it will be a standalone player it's going to have wi-fi in it it's going to be able to control your nano leaf lights and your phillips hue lights it's going to have the amazon streaming music on it which is kind of cool that's exciting news i can't wait to see that and that's it, man. Leave some comments below. Let me know what you think. Are you going to pick this thing up or are you going to pick this one up? Two channel, four channel. Uh, two channel, we're missing some pads. Kind of like that, uh, how they screwed us on the Dead and DJ Go a little bit. But that's okay. You might not need that many pads. And it's going to be interesting to see the actual physical size of these things. That's going to be the real change right there. Because it might be good, a good alternative for a portable guy. Anyways, that's it. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the alert button. We've always got new things coming out every day.